Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. Rothgar. Here to see the Greybeards again. To see what they know about a shout that can destroy Alduin. Your training proceeds well, Dragonborn. Mangir. Sky. Got you. I need to learn the shout used to defeat Alduin. Where did you learn of that? Who have you been talking to? Does it matter? Yes. For matters of such gravity, we need to know where you stand. Or who you stand with. Who I stand with is my business. If you wish to stand alone, so be it. If you wish for our help, you will answer my question. What? How dare you? Where did you learn of a shout used to defeat Alduin? It was recorded on Alduin's wall. The Blades, of course. They specialize in meddling in matters they barely understand. Their reckless arrogance knows no bounds. They have always sought to turn the Dragonborn from the path of wisdom. Have you learned nothing from us? Would you simply be a tool in the hands of the Blades to be used for their own purposes? The Blades just want to defeat Alduin, don't you? What I want is irrelevant. This shout was used once before, was it not? And here we are again. Have you considered that Alduin was not meant to be defeated? Those who overthrew him in ancient times only postponed the day of reckoning. They did not stop it. If the world is meant to end, so be it. Let it end and be reborn. So, you won't help me? No, not now. Not until you return to the path of wisdom. What did he say? Uh, forgive me, I was intemperate. I allowed my emotions to cloud my judgment. Master Einarth reminded me of my duty. The decision whether or not to help you is not mine to make. So, can you teach me this shout? No, I cannot teach it to you, because I do not know it. It is called Dragonrend, but its words of power are unknown to us. We do not regret this loss. Dragonrend holds no place within the way of the voice. Hmm. So you know the name of the shout? You knew exactly what I was talking about all along, and you withheld this from me. I thought you knew all the words of power. But not Dragonrend. The knowledge of that shout was lost in the time before history began. Perhaps only its creators ever knew it. But I am not the one to speak of it to you. What is so bad about Dragonrend? Why don't you tell me everything that you know? It was created by those who had lived under the unimaginable cruelty of Alduin's dragon cult. Their whole lives were consumed with hatred for dragons, and they poured all their anger and hatred into this shout. When you learn a shout, you take it into your very being. In a sense, you become the shout. In order to learn and use this shout, you will be taking this evil into yourself. <laughs> evil, huh? If the shout is lost, then how can I defeat Alduin? 
Only Patanax, the master of our order, can answer that question, if he so chooses. Wait a minute, don't... We're talking here. Thank you. Who is Parthenax? He is our leader. He surpasses us all in his mastery of the way of the voice. Why haven't I met Parthenax yet? He lives in seclusion on the very peak of the mountain. He speaks to us only rarely and never to outsiders. Being allowed to see him is a great privilege. Then how do I get to the top of the mountain? Only those whose voice is strong can find the path. We will teach you a shout to open the way to Parthenax. Well, at least there's that. Everything I can do not to attack these Greybeards. I've heard that they're nearly invulnerable, though. And all powerful. But they're trying my patience with all these secrets. to Parthenax lies through this gate. I will show you how to open the way. Doesn't look like anything can get through that gate. Look at those winds. Look. What? Ah. Cool. Understanding of clear skies. This is your final gift from us, Dragonborn. Use it well. All right. <laughs> Parthenax is perilous, not to be embarked upon lightly. Keep moving, stay focused on your goal, and you will reach the summit. Very well. Oh! <laughs> 
are the dangers the Greybeard spoke of. A lowly troll and several ice wraiths? Are they kidding me? Look! Look, greetings, Wundunik. I am Parthenax. You? But you're a dragon. Who are you? What brings you to my Strunmach, my mountain? I wasn't expecting you to be a dragon. I am as my father Akatosh made me, as are you, Dovakin. Tell me, why do you come here, Volan? Why do you intrude on my meditation? I need to learn the dragon rend shout. Can you teach me? Hmm. Drem. Patience. There are formalities which must be observed at the first meeting of two of the Dove. By long tradition, the Elder speaks first. Hear my Thum. Feel it in your bones. Match it, if you are Dova King. I have spoken. The Rotmulag waits. Then here goes. Ah, yes. Sosedo Vlostmul. The dragon blood runs strong in you. It is long since I had the pleasure of speech with one of my own kind. 
So, you have made your way here to me. No easy task for a jaw, mortal. Even for one of Dovah's source, dragon blood. What would you ask of me? Can you teach me the dragon wren shout? Ah, I had expected you, Proda. You would not come all this way for Tinvak with an old Dova. No, you seek your weapon against Alduin. How did you know that I came for Dragonrend? Alduin Comate Teed. What else would you seek? Alduin and Dovakin return together. But I do not know the Thune you seek. Croesus, it cannot be known to me. Your kind. Jaw, mortals, created it as a weapon against the Dove, the dragons. Our Hadrime, our minds, cannot even comprehend its concepts. Then how can I learn it? Drem, all in good time. First, a question for you. Why do you want to learn this, Thum? I like this world. I don't want it to end. Cruza has good a reason as any. There are many who feel as you do, although not all. Some would say that all things must end, so that the next can come to pass. Perhaps this world is simply the egg of the next Kalpa, Lean Vokin? Would you stop the next world from being born? I didn't come here to debate philosophy with you. <laughs> You have much to learn of the Dove, then. There is nothing else but philosophy to a Dova. It is no accident that we do battle with our Thum, our voices. There is no distinction between debate and combat to a dragon. Tinvak Loskra. For us, it is one and the same. But you have indulged my weakness for speech long enough. Croesus, now I will answer your question. Hmm. Do you know why I live here, at the peak of the Monaven, what you name Throat of the World? You said you were going to answer my question. Drim, patience. I am answering in my way. This is the most sacred mountain in Skyrim. Sokravakstruma, the great mountain of the world. Here, the ancient tongues, the first mortal masters of the voice, brought Alduin to battle, and defeated him. Using the Dragon Wren shout, no doubt. Hmm, yes and no. Viknuznikaron. Alduin was not truly defeated either. If he was, you would not be here today, seeking to defeat him. The Nords of those days used the Dragonrend shout to cripple Alduin, but this was not enough. Okmulag Unslad. 
It was the Kel, the Elder Scroll. They used it to cast him adrift on the currents of time. Are you saying the ancient Nord sent Alduin forward in time? Not intentionally. Some hoped he would be gone forever, forever lost. Maye. I knew better. Tidbo Amativ. Time flows ever onward. One day, he would surface. Which is why I have lived here. For thousands of mortal years, I have waited. I knew where he would emerge, but not when. I see, so you've been waiting for him here on this sacred mountain. So how does this help me? Tid Krent. Time was shattered here because of what the ancient Nords did to Alduin. If you brought that Kel, that Elder Scroll, back here to the Tid Ahran, the Time Wound, with the Elder Scroll that was used to break time, you may be able to cast yourself back to the other end of the break. You could learn Dragonrend from those who created it. <laughs> then I already have the Elder Scroll. I needed it to defeat, to defeat Harkon. You have it. The Kel, the Elder Scroll, Tidkrech, Kalos, time shudders at its touch. There is no question, you are doom-driven, Kogan Akatosh, the very bones of the Earth are at your disposal. Go then. Fulfill your destiny. Take the scroll to the Time Wound. Do not delay. Alduin will be coming. He cannot miss the signs. scroll next time yeah.